In this uh, video I would like to show you how to use selective coloring uh, with Lightroom and we, I'm going to show two different methods um, one is the easier and the other one is more uh, takes more work and the first way we're going to use uh, the go to the uh, ASL tab and choose saturation and in this picture I obviously want to uh, keep the red and uh, remove the, all the other colors so we're simply going to do just that by sliding all these colors to zero or to uh, minus 100 and as you can see the red is a, a bit pale um, we can bump up the saturation to make it more vivid and if you look closely you will see uh, not only the shirt, but there's, uh, still has color, but also uh, the lips and a bit here in the nose and the eye. Perhaps a bit in the skin, although it's pretty all white. And uh, well, when you have this problem, uh, you can fix this by using the second method. And to show the second method, I'm gonna zoom out and uh, undo the first and. Well, you can use both methods at once and start with the first and then go to the second but I'm going to show them separately okay and then the, for this method we'll use the adjustment brush and we'll simply turn uh, the saturation down to minus 100 and we'll just start painting over the areas we don't want in the same color or oh, don't want to color and they will turn to black and white quick scale and when you get uh, to the, the edges it's uh, always useful to use the auto mask function of Lightroom and it doesn't really matter if you go a bit over the edge because it will paint nicely along to it can use the bracket keys to make your brush bigger and smaller it's a bit in the hairs and mouth so it's a bit uh, uh, well, not the best uh, masking but uh, you get the point with some extra work you can make uh, it's a perfect mask and oh, here we have it the before picture and the after this is how selective coloring can be easily done in Lightroom 